One, two, three, let's go! Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the channel. I hope you're having an amazing, amazing, amazing day. Today, I'm going to be going on the ferry for the very first time. I'm just going to Bainbridge. Never been. I'm excited. I'm actually really excited. So let's just, let's just go. We're going on foot. We're going to explore the town on foot. A little rainy. Let's just, let's just get out there. shops, bookstores, I don't even know what's next. I filmed a little bit, I've been feeling a little shy at the same time, but let's keep going. adventure. This lighting is... better? One moment. There we go. Here we go. As you can see, it was raining outside. <laughs> I straightened my hair this morning and this is, this is what it's gone to. But I don't mind. I'll take the rain. I'll take a rainy day. It was my first kind of like it was my first time on the ferry, so I was a little nervous of figuring it out, but it was so easy. It was so easy to just, one, get my ticket. It was from Seattle to Bainbridge, like $9, a little over $9 for both. Like, you don't even need a ticket back. They're just like, just go on. Just go on the ferry back. But Bainbridge, cute town. It wasn't the best day to go out, I think, with the rain. Like, it was... There was a lot of rain the full time, but it was really cute. Um, just like fun little shops that were kind of a walkable distance. I wanna show you what I got. I wanna show you what I got. Um, well, I seem to already lost, lost my little pen that I, um, <laughs> I got from the toy store because the toy store was so cool. It was such a cute little shop. And I know I only filmed somewhat. I'm still working on my courage, you guys. I'm sorry. But it was it was a really cute shop. Um, and then, of course, I went to a bookstore, obviously. And I went right to find like the romance section. I had to look around a little bit. I told myself, okay, you can get a book. You can get one book. I got two. So, 
only one more um and to be fair i always use my like kindle unlimited so actually getting a book it's those giddy it's the giddy sort of feelings you know the first here i've already read this one <laughs> I've already read this one. It's called All Roads Lead Here by Mariana Zapata. You guys, if you have not, if you haven't read her books, please do. Please do. If you're into romance, it is like, I I mean, I have already reread multiple of her books. Rereading this book will be like, I will, I know I'm going to enjoy every single moment as if I'm reading it for the first time. It she's amazing she's amazing top slow burn i know this is age gap kind of single dad um a little bit of forced proximity like living together it's it's fun it's fun and <laughs> i i'm so excited also i know it's gonna have like a new little bonus content they did that with the wall of wooden pick too another great one Coltai has not had one yet but Coltai is my favorite by her anyways if you're a reader do it and then another i've been wanting to get this book and also it's not on kindle unlimited and i've been saying you know what if i go to a bookstore and i see it then i'm getting it i almost didn't see it but i did fangirl down i know it's like a little grumpy sunshine it's by tessa bailey and i she's usually also <laughs> i'll read her books and i'll enjoy every moment of it so especially a lot of her grumpy sunshine i've <laughs> I love them. I love them. So we're gonna read this one and look. Oh, it makes me happy. I don't know. That's probably my favorite purchase that I got. Then whoa. I went to like a crystal shop. I didn't get crystals. I got some oracle cards. Angel answers oracle cards. Actually I feel like this would be very helpful. I <laughs> I do use my tarot cards. I use some fun oracle stuff already. And these are just seem like positive messages. And I think sometimes, especially when I'm freaking out and I'm trying to ask it an answer when I really should just be talking to myself, a positive answer from Angel will be nice. Um, I'm excited to use these. I'll, I'll cut into them in a moment and kind of show you a little more what they look like. They're like pocket pocket sized but the store had so many fun like decks crystals and i did see one book that i was like i i thought about getting it i got my romance books instead but um it was the birthday book and it had every single birthday throughout the year and like the importance of like the like people of these days what they're like and i was reading a little bit of mine and to say how accurate it was was crazy i i think i astrology is still something i'm like kind of kind of not you know what i mean either way but it was super super accurate so i might i don't know i might get that book try to find it at some other point i got these oh my goodness i thought this was gonna be a cute little opening <laughs> like wow voila here we go. Oh, here's a little booklet. I won't show you guys all the cards, but uh, a year from now, ask. Okay, so it has like a lot of different like actual answers, which is fun. I don't have any cards that like tell you actual answers. I have tarot and then very much like mind warping sort of oracles, which are fun. But nothing that's... I don't think I have anything so direct. So like it says, ask, ask for help from others. A year from now, ask your angels. Be assertive. Big happy changes. This is what I, this is, we're getting that energy. But that's fun. Oh, I think it might be divided into different ones too. How fun. Okay. So I got those. The last thing I got was actually coming back from the fairy so while i was there i went to the crystal shop i went to a little bakery got some hot chocolate i went to this museum that i stayed a very very small time and it just wasn't my thing very much um but it was cool and then i went to an art museum which was awesome like <laughs> it was so fun i don't know why i 
I really enjoy looking at like the paintings like just different I don't know different kind of story I don't know just like the paintings of like the cool paintings that you would see you know in the renaissance period they give me they give me like little ideas like little book ideas or just imagination things I have fun with those but I went to the art museum and I spent quite a while there and then I think I finally walked back to the ferry after I left the ferry there's a lot of different stuff by the pier in fact there's multiple piers that you just walk down but there's one called like a curio curiosity shop and I saw it while going there and I'm like I kind of want to kind of want to check it out and then I went there going back and so like fun so fun if you're ever in Seattle and you're going by the pier I would say go into that shop it had a bunch of well th I remember the skulls I remember a lot of skulls and <laughs> like just weird stuff just weird stuff which is like right down my alley a lot of like different coin operated things like fortune telling um just you know the like little you put your dollar in and it gives you something and ships in a bottle I think it had sharks in like a bottle like real ones and that kind of made me sad i don't know i didn't i didn't like that one um I, I don't know it had a ton ton of stuff but there was a bunch of these like little lego characters and it said like you could get three in a mystery bag so i want to get these three i got i don't know what they are yet i might not actually know who they are because a lot of the characters i had no idea of but i love like surprise things <laughs> i have a lot of fun with that Okay, this first guy, I have no idea who he is. You're going to have to help me if you know him. That's probably not super helpful. Whoa, 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 whoa. So he has a face, <laughs> obviously. Little smiley face. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <sighs> Fun helmet. He's some sort of space dude. Now is he a real like a character or is he just some sort of space dude? This man? I have this man. I don't know what he's from. <laughs> he's kind of fun though, a little space explorer. Then I have Okay. It's giving like Indiana Jones vibes, but I'm probably well maybe not, actually. <laughs> Okay, I might be very uncultured with a lot of like these movies or <laughs> I don't even know what it's from. What is with his arms? What? He has weird arms. And a unicorn. I mean, I don't think I can say that. And a... And something else. That goes pew. What? <gasps> Not the helmet. He has an extra hand, I'm guessing, just in case I lose it, which... Whoa. <gasps> he turns smiley. Wait. What? Okay, okay, okay. Look, this seems like an outfit, right? Smiley, mister? Or serious? Serious, dude. We're gonna leave him on serious because I like serious people. And he has this full little jacket going on. I actually have no idea who this is either. Um, again, if you know any of the people, please let me know. I was thinking Indiana Jones, but I don't, why are his hands, why did they seem like they might be like skeleton hands? Is he a skeleton man? Half alive, half, not alive crawling from the underworld to get the snow monsters i don't know if i can show that so i'll just go that's my second guy he's pretty cool too let's see third person oh i know you you're not a favorite man of mine but i know you pretty sure this is the emperor or oh, wait no this is oh! 
Annie. Annie. Well, before, well, after. Okay, this is the best one. This is the best one. I'm not even gonna lie. I love Anakin. I do. Say I love a bad boy. I don't know. But the only like Star Wars that I watched for a really long time was the like see, you know, or I guess that they would be the prequels. Um, with Anakin's story, <laughs> and I used to have a, I used to have a bit of a crush to be honest. Where does this go? Hey So his cape, having a very hard time staying on. Honestly, his arm too. And if he keeps dropping the sword. His lightsaber, his lightsaber. I'm so sorry, Star Wars people. <laughs> his lightsaber. I'm just gonna take it from him and use it. But, <laughs> how cool. I don't know, surprise things, they're the best. I feel like even when they're, you know, people that I don't really know they just they just feel more exciting but you're my three little dudes I if you know who this is if you know who the second one is let me know I know who this guy is that's everything that I got though um I also got a cat pen like I've been saying but I have no idea where that went anyway you guys that was my vlog I forgot to end it I'm sorry but I'm back home for Easter, so you get to at least see my dog for a little bit for the end of the vlog. Yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Excited to see you again next time. Goodbye. <laughs>